The volcano finally erupted. Volcanoes have shaped our planet and sometimes destroyed everything in their path. From ancient disasters to modern-day eruptions, these are the largest volcanic eruptions in history, ranked by destruction, impact, and sheer explosive power. Number 1. Mount Tambora, Indonesia, 1815 Mount Tambora didn't just erupt, it detonated. In April 1815, this volcano on the Indonesian island of Sumbawa unleashed the most powerful volcanic eruption in recorded history. The blast was so intense, it was heard over 1,200 miles away, and the column of ash rose more than 40 kilometers into the sky. The eruption measured a VEI, Volcanic Explosivity Index, of 7, a level so extreme it's almost impossible to comprehend. But the destruction didn't stop there. The explosion caused massive pyroclastic flows, tsunamis, and widespread ashfall. Local villages were instantly buried, and more than 71,000 people died, many from starvation and disease that followed the eruption. The ash clouds spread globally, blocking sunlight and drastically dropping temperatures. The year that followed, 1816, became known as the year without a summer. Crops failed in North America and Europe. Snow fell in June, famine spread across continents. Today, Tambora's enormous caldera stands as a chilling reminder of its power, measuring 7 kilometers wide and 1,100 meters deep. Though it last erupted in 1967, scientists still classify it as active. But if you thought Tambora was terrifying, wait till you hear about a volcano that literally shattered an island and caused one of the loudest sounds in human history. Number 2. Krakatoa, Indonesia, 1883 and 2018 In 1883, the island volcano of Krakatoa in Indonesia exploded with a fury so intense, it's often described as one of the loudest sounds in recorded history. The blast was reportedly heard over 3,000 miles away, all the way in Australia and even on islands off the coast of Africa. Its Volcanic Explosivity Index, VEI, was a massive six, and it caused the collapse of over two-thirds of the island. But it wasn't just the eruption that was deadly. It triggered a tsunami over 120 feet tall, wiping out more than 165 coastal villages and killing an estimated 36,000 people. The sky turned blood red for days, and global temperatures dropped for years. Krakatoa was so loud and violent, it literally changed the way the world viewed volcanoes. What's more haunting? The volcano came back. A new cone called Anak Krakatau, child of Krakatoa, emerged in 1927 and has been active ever since. In 2018 it erupted again, this time triggering another deadly tsunami, caught on HD camera as it struck a beachside concert in real time. But if Krakatoa ripped islands apart, the next volcano buried an entire Roman city and left behind human shadows frozen in ash. Number 3. Mount Vesuvius, Italy, 79 AD The volcano finally erupted, sending molten rock 15 kilometers into the sky. When Mount Vesuvius erupted in 79 AD, it didn't just destroy cities, it froze a moment in history. The explosion released a towering ash column and deadly pyroclastic flows that buried the Roman cities of Pompeii and Herculaneum within hours. Over 16,000 people are believed to have died, many of them preserved in haunting poses beneath layers of ash and pumice. The eruption's VEI, Volcanic Explosivity Index, was 5, but the devastation was amplified by how close the population lived to the volcano and how little they knew of its power. HD recreations and archaeological footage show casts of people clutching each other, crouched in fear, or lying in bed, perfectly frozen in time. It's one of the most chilling time capsules ever discovered. Vesuvius last erupted in 1944, and it's still classified as active, threatening the densely populated Naples metropolitan area, home to over three million people. As the eruption continued, the magma chamber eventually emptied and collapsed. Scientists say it's not a matter of if, but when. 
Even with ancient warnings burned into stone and ash, people still live in its shadow. But while Vesuvius left a haunting reminder, the next volcano incinerated an entire city in seconds and left only one survivor behind. Number 4. Mount Pele, Martinique, 1902 When Mount Pele erupted at 8.02 a.m., the explosion produced a sound so loud in 1902, Mount Pelé erupted with terrifying speed on the Caribbean island of Martinique. Unlike slow lava flows, this eruption unleashed a pyroclastic flow, a superheated, fast-moving avalanche of gas and ash that swept down the mountain at over 100 miles per hour. The massive pyroclastic flow, a death cloud of superheated gases. The city of Saint-Pierre, home to 30,000 people, was wiped out almost instantly. Nearly all residents perished, except for one man who survived by being locked inside a stone prison cell. Mount Pele's eruption had a VEI, Volcanic Explosivity Index of 4, but its impact was devastating because of the deadly pyroclastic flow, which is one of the deadliest volcanic phenomena. The city was reduced to ruins in minutes, and the island's economy suffered for years. Today, the volcano is calm, but closely monitored by volcanologists. Imagine a force so fast, so hot, it can erase entire cities in the blink of an eye, but wait till you hear about the colossal eruption that rocked a whole continent just a few years later. Number 5. Mount Street, Helens, Washington, USA, Nittanati. On May 18, 1980, Mount St. Helens erupted in one of the most well-documented volcanic events in recent history. Unlike typical eruptions, this one blasted sideways, sending a massive landslide and a roaring pyroclastic surge down the north face. The explosion was so violent it reduced the mountain's height by over 1,300 feet. The eruption had a VEI, Volcanic Explosivity Index, of 5, and although it lasted only 9 hours, it caused devastating effects. 57 people died, and hundreds of square miles of forest were flattened. Ash clouds circled the globe, causing minor climate effects. What makes this eruption stand out is the incredible HD footage captured as the blast unfolded, a dramatic and terrifying glimpse of nature's power in action. Today, St. Helens remains active and monitored closely. Its landscape is still recovering from the devastation, offering scientists a natural laboratory to study volcanic recovery. But if you think Mount St. Helens was a rare one-off event, just wait, because the next volcano erupted in the 90s and cooled the entire planet for years, affecting millions worldwide. Number 6. Mount Pinatubo, Philippines, 1991 Mount Pinatubo erupted, sending ash and gas thousands of feet into the sky. After nearly 500 years of dormancy, Mount Pinatubo erupted in June 1991 with a cataclysmic blast that shocked the world. Rated a VEI, Volcanic Explosivity Index, 6. This eruption sent an enormous ash cloud soaring 22 miles into the stratosphere, darkening skies and triggering global climate changes. The ash and sulfur dioxide ejected cooled the Earth's surface by roughly 0.5 degrees Celsius for nearly two years, a volcanic global air conditioner. Before the eruption, scientists had warned nearby communities, allowing over 60,000 people to evacuate. Despite this, over 800 lives were lost, primarily due to roof collapses from heavy ash and flash floods caused by volcanic mudflows called lahars. Around 200,000 people were displaced, their homes and livelihoods buried under thick volcanic debris. The eruption also caused extensive damage to U.S. military bases at Clark and Subic Bay, forcing evacuations and economic disruptions. HD footage captures the relentless flow of lava and towering ash plumes, showing the terrifying raw force of nature. Today, Mount Pinatubo is quiet but far from forgotten. The once devastated landscape is now a lush crater lake, and scientists keep a watchful eye on this sleeping giant. The 1991 eruption remains a vivid reminder of how volcanoes can reshape not only the land, but also the planet's climate. After Mount Pinatubo's explosive blast that shook the world and cooled the planet, you might think such eruptions are rare in modern times. But just recently, a volcano in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean erupted with rivers of lava flowing like fire itself was unleashed, burying towns and reshaping an island before our eyes. After Pinatubo's massive blast, you'd think such eruptions are ancient history. But in 2021, La Palma erupted, 
sending rivers of lava that buried entire towns in fire. Number 7. La Palma, Cumbre Vieja, Canary Islands, Spain, 2021. La Palma has been evacuated because of the ongoing eruption of a nearby volcano. In September 2021, the Cumbre Vieja volcano on the Spanish island of La Palma erupted after decades of dormancy. This eruption surprised locals and scientists alike, producing spectacular rivers of glowing lava that flowed down the mountain slopes, destroying entire neighborhoods. The eruption lasted for over three months, making it one of the longest lasting in recent European history. Rated a VEI, Volcanic Explosivity Index, of 3 to 4, the eruption was relatively moderate compared to supervolcanoes, but the impact on local communities was severe. Over 7,000 people were evacuated, hundreds of homes were lost, and vast areas of farmland and infrastructure were buried under lava flows. The continuous emission of ash forced airport closures and disrupted travel in and around the Canary Islands. HD footage captured the mesmerizing yet terrifying sight of flowing lava cutting through forests, roads and towns. Satellite imagery showed the rapid transformation of the landscape, highlighting the raw destructive power of this volcano. Scientists continue to monitor Cumbre Vieja closely as its ongoing activity shows how even relatively small volcanoes can cause massive disruption. From fiery lava streams in the Atlantic, we move to a European giant with a history of explosive activity that has shaped civilizations for millennia. Number 8. Mount Etna, Italy, ongoing activity. Mount Etna, located on the eastern coast of Sicily, Italy, is Europe's most active volcano and one of the world's tallest, standing over 3,300 meters high. Unlike sudden catastrophic eruptions, Etna is known for its frequent, sometimes daily eruptions that produce spectacular lava fountains, ash clouds and lava flows. Its activity has been recorded for over 2,700 years, making it one of the longest studied volcanoes in history. Though many of its eruptions are moderate, typically 5 to 3, Etna's persistent activity has caused significant damage. Towns nearby have experienced lava flows destroying homes, roads and vineyards. In 1669, a massive eruption sent lava flooding toward Catania, one of Sicily's largest cities, devastating farmland and infrastructure. Thanks to its location near populated areas and major cities, high-definition footage and drone videos of Mount Etna's eruptions are widely available, making it a favorite for volcanic documentaries. Today, Etna continues to erupt regularly, reminding scientists and locals alike of the delicate balance between nature's beauty and destructive power. From Europe's fiery giant, we journey next to an eruption that stopped the skies, grounding thousands of flights and disrupting lives across an entire continent. Number 9. Ejafjallajökull, Iceland, 2010. In April 2010, the Icelandic volcano Ejafjallajökull erupted and unexpectedly shook the modern world. While not one of the largest eruptions by volume, its VEI, Volcanic Explosivity Index, of four and the unique nature of the eruption caused massive disruption. The eruption sent a massive ash cloud high into the atmosphere, which was carried by winds across Europe, grounding over 100,000 flights and leaving millions stranded. This ash cloud became infamous for shutting down the busiest airspace in the world for nearly a week, costing airlines billions of dollars. Despite the economic impact, Ejafjalla Jakul's eruption caused no direct deaths, making it an unusual but powerful example of volcanic influence in the age of global travel. HD footage and time-lapses captured the eruption's explosive bursts, glowing lava, and the slow melting of the glacier covering the volcano, adding dramatic visuals that fascinated millions worldwide. Scientists continue to monitor Ejafjallajökull closely, aware that Iceland's unique volcanic activity can have outsized effects on global weather and economies. If you thought grounding flights was disruptive, wait until you hear about the powerful eruption that shook the Caribbean, blanketing entire islands in ash and forcing tens of thousands to flee for their lives. Number 10. La Soufrière, Saint Vincent and the Grenadines, 2021. The most recent major eruption on our list comes from the Caribbean island of St. Vincent, where La Soufrière volcano awoke violently in April 2021 after decades of dormancy. Rated a VEI, Volcanic Explosivity Index of 4, 
This eruption sent plumes of ash soaring over 15 kilometers into the sky, blanketing the island in thick volcanic ash and forcing tens of thousands of residents to evacuate. The eruption was explosive and unpredictable, with multiple phases including powerful pyroclastic flows that devastated large swaths of the island's northern region. Though no fatalities were officially reported, the eruption caused widespread destruction to homes, farmland and infrastructure, disrupting lives and livelihoods. Thanks to modern technology, there's an abundance of high-definition footage of the eruption, from drone shots soaring over the ash-covered landscape to dramatic captures of glowing lava fountains at night. The event reminded the world how active and dangerous volcanoes remain, especially for communities living in their shadows. Scientists continue to monitor La Soufrière closely, as the region's volcanic activity remains dynamic and volatile. Which eruption blew your mind the most? Ancient disasters or the modern-day firestorms? Let us know in the comments, we'd love to hear what shook you the hardest. If you found this video interesting, hit that like button and subscribe for more epic stories of nature's power. Thanks for watching, see you in the next one.